Welcome to a new Minecraft Let's Play episode in Oniverse. I'm your host, Oniverse 27 here, and I welcome you back here after a short while. And yes, yes, that looks creepy. Anyway, uh, so what is the plan for this episode, you may ask? You may ask, and rightfully so. Yes, I died last episode, now I have 40 levels. I feel so happy. I went a bit. I did went and did a bit of mining. Uh, got because I still had my Fortune three pickaxe. I used that to fortune all the ores. Got to thirty two levels. Then I fished, 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 and now I have forty levels, and I'm pretty happy. So the idea is to first at least get some enchantments going, and then after that I have I have a couple of items there. Down there in my fishing farm that we're now gonna go and pick up. Let's put armor on. Yes, I already prepared. I have some wood. I have some diamonds. Yeah. So I have a couple of items there in my fishing farm that I want to combine. I have a. I have a bow. I have some bows there. I have some books there that I've gotten from fishing. And yes, I love this pyramid. Uh, and then I have some fishing rods here. Look at it, look at all this good stuff. Can, I, can we do that? No. Oh. Great. Okay, so let's just grab all this stuff and then take it to the enchanting area because that's where it will be used. Be back in a minute. Okay, so here we are now. I have all the books here, so let's go through them. Fire aspect one. Feather Falling 4, that's great. So if we could enchant some diamond boots with... What is it? The swimming thing. Anyway. Anyway. Uh, then we could get some great boots. Lack, Lack of the Sea 2, Looting 2, not terribly exciting. Smite 4, Knockback 2, Unbreaking 3. Mm, interesting. Unbreaking 3, Power 4, that's great for a bow. To make it like a Power 5 bow, but... All these bows seem to be pretty good already. Mending, knock back to Bane of Arthropus 4. Yes, I have a mending book. I don't know what to put it on. I'm thinking about a s about my bow, about my s sword. Uh, lots of things. I'm not I'm not completely s sure. Black of the Sea 2, not too exciting. Fire Protection 3, Respiration 3, Efficiency 3. Then we have Mending, yeah. Crops on the Fishing Rods. Uh, there, there were a couple... There was one that was really good, that just needed like one. Yeah, look at this. Mending, Luck of the Sea, to Unbreaking 3. And then we add this to it. And it's the ultimate fishing rod. But first, I think we should enchant some gear. So please enjoy the Enchanto Labs. <laughs> Okay, so we did get some pretty good stuff on our axe and our, and our shovel or spade, as you want to call it, and our boots. So just look at this, guys. Protection for unbreaking three, depth spider three. When we add the, when we add the whatever it is, the feather falling to this, it's gonna be insane, insane, guys. Can you imagine it? I, I think we still wanna enchant our sword, by the way, and our pick as well. Mm. Gotta gather, gather a bit more XP. Uh, then we have uh, Unbreaking 3, Efficiency 4 on our Shovel and our X. I think they are both really good enchantments. <sighs> yeah. Mending would be cool, but no. 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 So yeah. Let's enchant our pick. I don't think the sword is as crucial at the moment because, yeah. Well, it's, it's night, but yeah. We're, we're, the area is pretty well lit up. Efficiency 4, good. Efficiency 4, silk dodge. Mm -hmm. I kind of would have wanted unbreaking on it. I think I have an unbreaking book, so yeah. Let me figure out which books and which things I want to combine, and then I'll be back when the sun is up. Okay, so here is what we're gonna do. First, we're gonna combine our boots with the Feather Falling 4 book. 
and they will be the ultimate boots. We just need to remember to repair them every now and again. Then we're gonna do our fishing rod. It will it will have all the possible enchants the fishing rod will have at the max level. That will be great. We'll make a power unbreaking three, power five, punch, and punch one and flame bow, and then we'll add this unbreaking book to our our pickaxe. So let's start. There we go. Uh, let's see. Twenty six levels. Jeez. Twenty four. Wow. Mm, I think we can wait with that fishing rod. I think that this pick is the most important at the minute. Three. Great. Uh, 16. 12. Yes. Oh, and our anvil broke. Great. Well, we need a new anvil. Well, I'll see you in a bit when we start building some stuff that I have planned for this episode. Woohoo! Okay, here is our next project. What is it, you may ask, and rightfully so. Uh, it's because, you know, at the moment it's just a bunch of blocks in a square shape. If you're really observant, you may know what it is. But I'm not expecting you to know. Uh, let me tell you before before you leave, is that it's a sheep farm. It's an actually it's gonna be an AFK sheep farm. So how how it's gonna work is that here's gonna be a piston da tape that somehow I don't know how it works, but anyway, uh, there's a piston tape rotating the sheep around, and it's great. And then we 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 stand here or something, and then we. Share and breed them, share and breed them, and then the babies, after they've been bred, they fall in here, here is some water, they get pushed here, here is a deep hole, yet to be a dick, dag, dag, yeah I think it's dag, and then we can, then they grow into adults, and then we can burn them with lava, and get some, or something, I don't know, or then kill them for XP, I think that's a great idea. There we go. Uh, and yeah, the biggest pain will be to try and get all the sheep here. Yep, I can already feel the pain. That's not gonna happen on camera. Let me tell you that much. Yeah, all oh, my my sheep are there currently. I need to. I guess I, I think I'm gonna build a, some like a minecart track or something. I don't know yet. I'm already crying because I bought, brought them from there to there, and now I'm building this here. Well, yeah. Let me get the piston tape in, and we'll see you then. After I messed around with this thing for like two hours or something, yeah, <laughs> yeah, it would be good to take good screenshots of the design or something, I don't know. There wasn't even a tutorial out there, there was just a world download. Anyway, here we have it. It is finally working, it took me way too long. But just look at it. So the idea is that the sheep will rotate there, I don't know by what logic they'll stay in there and move with it. But it works, I'm not questioning it. Now, now the next part is to move this lever down there, we'll need to make a pod here. Where we can stand. Oopsie, oopsie daisy. Anyway, like, and then that that's where it will come down, and then we'll need to make the shearing bay. Oh, we don't want that there. Shearing bay here somewhere. And yeah, it's working now. I'm really happy. It took, yes, I, it took me way too long. So yeah, try me, let's, let me just figure out the next part and I'll build it, and then we'll meet back here. In the moment. Guys, you know what? The raw building process of this thing is complete. It works. There's only one problem. We can't make any shears because, yeah, we're kind of out of iron. Because I had to make. 
because I made all these hoppers. So I feel like I need to go to do some mining. But b before I go, I just want to show you this. Just look at this. So the idea is here. Oh yeah, that, that needs to be taken away. So the idea is that we stand here, we hold both bu both buttons down, and then the sheep rotate around. We can go AFK, or whatever we want, and then we just yeah breed the sheep, shear the sheep. They go around and around and around. The thing is that our sheep are there. We need to bring them here. I think yeah, it's gonna be a mess. But I think what what's this, what the smartest thing to do would be ah, would be to always like rotate this by one spot or like two or like two times. Make a path somewhere here where it makes sense. Like yeah, maybe put the all the sheep like right right there. Make a path from to up here. Make always sure that there's only one sheep coming at a time. And yeah, it's gonna be a pain. And then just rotate it, rotate it, rotate it, till we get all the sheep in. The problem is getting the sheep in. Anyway, uh, yeah, so let me go do some mining, get some iron, get some other stuff, and yeah, be back in a second. L look at this, guys, look at this, the four horsemen. Let's. Why are they shooting at each other? Come on, I'm the, I'm the, I'm the one you should be shooting at, guys. Guys, sure, seriously, seriously, seriously. Ah! I killed the horse. I killed the horse. No. Seems like we got two horses out of that. Just, yeah. Let's continue the episode. And now we are here as well. Great. Anyway, as you see, some, we have managed to get some of the sheep in here and rotating around. Yeah. I'm just waiting to get the rest in. Yeah. I'm just kind of pushing them with water and trying to encourage them to go through. As you see, I have a bit of mutton in my hand. I had to kill a couple of sheep here and there. Other than that, everything should be fine, and here we can still get out. Oh, good, 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 good brownie, good brown shape here. Good, yeah. Yeah, I, I made this little tunnel mess thing. Yeah, it's a mess. Anyway, let's breed the sh a couple of sheep here. Because I don't think we have enough sheep over there trying to get in currently. So, yeah. It's a pretty slow and grindy project. I'm, I'm probably not doing it the optimal way. But, you know. Who cares? Sooner or later, we'll get it done. Hopefully, sooner than later. Okay, guys, so I don't think I'm gonna be able to get this finished during this episode. I think I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna try and finish this before next episode. Ah oh, yeah, it's been Oni27 here, this has been Oniverse, thanks for watching, see you next time.
Come on, Minecraft. Or something else. You never know. See you next time. Goodbye.